It was Benjamin Franklin who first said that hunger is the best pickle. And honestly, what does that even mean? Hunger is the best pickle? I don't know, Benjamin Franklin said lots of clever things in his day, many of which I understand, but that one I've n never had any sense whatsoever what he was trying to get at with that one. I don't know. I, don't get me wrong, I'm a big fan of Benjamin Franklin. You know, especially the way he was a philanderer and treated his family so terribly. Although, you know, even that, I guess, you know, you're being too hard on him. You know, lots of people in the old world were, you know, what we might call assholes today. You know, I mean, you go back really far, like Beowulf, major asshole. Hercules, he's a total dick. In fact, everyone, everyone from the old world is kind of an asshole. YouTube, this is Praxis Prepper. If you're like me and my family and you follow the mantra of kind of like, if it's yellow, let it mellow, you might notice that you get some, I think it's like calcium buildup or just generally the toilet, get some stains and things like that from letting stuff sit in there. And I've developed a technique for using pickle juice to clean all that out. And I wouldn't really say it's that much of a technique here. I'll, I'll, I'll show you it. So open up. See this, you know, some, we also have like some iron in our water so we get little stains and things like that. Whatever it is, the acid, in the pickle juice, I just pour in, this is the technique, I pour in empty uh, pickle juice containers after I use all the pickles. Ah, oh, crap. There was a pickle in there. I'm not gonna fish it out. <laughs> you know, I do some crazy shit, but no, that one can go. Ah, man, how did I miss that? It was a whole pickle. It was a, it was a small pickle, but. Anyway, okay, so you pour it in here and you just let it sit for a while. That's the trick in my house is trying to find a time when people aren't using the toilet because uh, you want the stuff to sit in there for a while. Uh, you know, overnight would normally be the time, but I'm not the last one to go to bed. Amber's usually the last one to go to bed. Um, and I don't know, it just never works out that she remembers to do it. So, uh, so the trick for me is trying to find a time when, you know, this can just sit here for a while. People aren't going to be using it. Uh, this is the middle of the day. Amber just went off to college and River's at school and I'll just pee outside. So I'm just going to let it sit in there. I'm going to grab the uh, uh, toilet brush and take this and just kind of flush it up on the sides here. And you let it sit there for a while and it really just, wa oh man, that pickle, that little pickle floating around. Uh, you just let it sit in here and it just softens everything up and then that's it. And then it dissolves away nicely, and then next time you scrub it, it comes out pretty clean. I always like when you can use a byproduct or something that's left over to solve some other problem. And this is a great example of that. Not very exciting, but uh, it allows you to save lots of water by not flushing all the time, and at the same time having a clean appearing toilet, and it doesn't cost you any money, unless you had some other purpose for the pickle juice. I know some people drink it. That's not my bag. So this is a good use for me. That's it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video. And if you'd like to support this channel, you can do so both through Patreon or PayPal.